Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, with Mr. Todd Weisenbaker. It's Edibles at Night, woo once woo! again. Fumpin' Thursday. Fumpin' Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, Ty? Doing great. Good. We're good. ready for the holiday season. Good day here at Norman's yeah, Guitars. Yeah, it was. It was. I think the holiday season's been good, too. People are coming through buying guitars and... Appreciate the support. Yeah, we That's really nice. do. And, uh, and we're giving back a little bit. Yeah, we are. Today we tuned up uh, about... 60 guitars um, that we're going to give to the Midnight Mission on Christmas Day. And remember, we're closed and we reopen on January 2nd. Um, but yeah, we're going to give away some guitars and toys. and some, There's teddy bears everywhere. I don't know if you guys have seen these photos. But they're everywhere. Keep like catching them in like yeah, positions. yeah. They've they're, been yeah. behind you, Lemo and, and a couple of guitar today. I know, I know. They're everywhere. <laughs> so uh, yeah, some of those bears are Extremely also going probably. to the... Uh, the children uh, downtown, and uh, and uh, so we're looking forward to that. And Norm will be there, even our own John Tucci. So uh, that'll be great. And what else? Not much. We got a uh, we had a a band get together earlier. The band mostly has broken up since then. Yeah, yeah. So you might catch some of that. Today we're doing some Christmas tunes. Yeah. And we're starting off with a good one, I think. <laughs> one of my favorites. And I want you to uh, be really uh, truthful in how the new additions to the band sound. Yeah, yeah, really. And at them directly. Zero in at Joel. <laughs> He's the one on the drums. We want to know what you guys think. Should Joel be in Edibles at night? Uh... Inedible, sometimes it's inedible. Yeah. <laughs> A little hard to stomach. Um. <laughs> oh my god, that was great. So it's uh, Thursday, Thumping Thursday, the band's back together. I'm coming back because I'm not going to be in your way. Okay, uh, from 1976. I already did that one because oh. it's kind of crooked. <laughs> 1976, Fender Precision Bass and See Through Blonde. Wow, I love this one. Booyah! Me too. Gorgeous. The color is. My favorite. Very unique. You can see the grain underneath it. And it's yellowed to a really cool kind of a, it's still white-ish. Finish checking. Um, what condition would you call this? What would you say? Eight out of 10? Flip it over. There's like some ch uh, chipping there. I don't know, it's it's up there. It's 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 been played, the frets are in good shape. Okay, so what would you say? What do we got? Uh, I'm gonna give it a seven. Seven out of ten. Okay. I give it a seven. Too. Seven. It's pretty right. good. Yeah. I oversell a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, P bass. <laughs> so the uh, the P bass. Let's go over a little bit of history before we get into this particular era. We have introduced in '51, the '51 to '57. It's kind of the Tele style. This was introduced as sort of a uh, Strat-esque contoured body, split humbucker pickup, real punchy, real bright, classic. Uh, this is a CBS era, just bad boy. One, one clean mother. <laughs> to me, <laughs> this reminds me of the Didi Ramon bass, though his was fully white uh, with a black pickguard, but it's just... We didn't. We played Christmas songs, and although I think there is a Christmas, maybe we'll do a Christmas Ramon song some other time. Um, <laughs> just came Christmas. to me. <laughs> just came to me. Um, but yeah, this one, 34 inch scale. This is just the bass to me. When it comes to tone, nice wide nut. Yes. How many? Um, how many uh, frets? <laughs> Got 20 frets on this bad boy. Um, eight else. This is the OG case, obviously. And we have this thing. Though, why would you? I almost wanted to take that off because I couldn't palm it. Um, yeah. Hey, hey, would you like to add anything? I think it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> no, it sounds yeah. great. I mean, and you can't go wrong with a P bass. You cannot go wrong with a P bass. But this one is really cool. Not it really you... thumps, though. It's like This is a very yeah. punchy, bright, thumpy um, example. As you would expect, if you're looking for a, a mid '70s Fender P bass, I encourage you to check this one on uh, Reverb and buy it. Yes. You know, so we're here. <laughs> Tis the season to sell guitars. 
Should we go out front? I Rock think it? we should go out front. Assemble the band of uh, elves. Let's find out who is on drums. <laughs> See if we really like this guy. We are up front, a very chilled out day at Norm's Rare Guitars. Nothing happening. Nothing at all. <laughs> uh, 1976 P bass, look at how creamy and mapley and just fabulous this thing is. So what did you cool. pick up? I kind of went a little hard yeah. today, but I, I grabbed the 1970 ES335 cherry finish. Um, it's got that kind of taper neck up top. But uh, I thought it was kind of Christmassy. It is kind of Christmassy, especially what, what we got uh, prepared for you all. We have a, a few, couple, a uh, few elves that are gonna join us halfway through. Hope you like it, hope you enjoy it. Kick right. it off, man. Saved by the Bell. <laughs> they, they formed Zack Attack. <laughs> yeah. There it is. Happy There's holidays, that. guys. Happy holidays. Hey, guys. Show, all the, show all the guitars we're working yeah, on. Yeah, look, we're giving oh, away all these guitars to the Midnight oh, Mission. Yeah, we, we so to make sure you give. It feels good to give. <laughs> <laughs> a wild day here at Norm's. Yeah. Wow. Thanks for watching and happy holidays and Merry Christmas. And, 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 uh, happy Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah. Yeah. Hanukkah. Yeah. Merry Christmas. All right, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye. 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 See you next year!
Joel might have been. You have the duo. Wow, that's pretty good. 